Hello, I'm Chris Okersey, and I'm with the irrigation information website, smartirrigation.com. And we're here to show you how to set a Hunter PGP rotor. Today we have a Hunter PGP Ultra, and uh, the setting procedure is similar to any other Hunter head, the PGP regular or the PGJ. Um, it's hitting the fence now, so we got the left stop is not good. And the right stop, just gently on the gears, I'm speeding it up, and it clicks there. So it's not going far enough to the right. Hunter heads are right stop. So the right stop is constant, and the left stop is adjustable with the key. So we're gonna start with the right stop, and then we're gonna adjust the left stop with the key. So I wanted to go basically a 90 in this direction. Now the official way is to remove the cartridge, dig it up, and turn it, the cartridge, and then retighten it into the case. But we're going to show you the quicker unofficial way, which works. And we've been doing it for decades without any problems. We grab the base below the turret and we rotate just like a spray head now it's actually not turning in the ground it's clicking inside uh, the case it's a little hard sometimes when you have a wet rotor but never be tempted to use pliers because you will damage the, the shaft and that will cause issues with your seals in the future if you scratch the shaft okay so we, uh, we've roughly set the right stop, and uh, you can tell by basically doing that, and that gives you a rough idea where it's going to stop. And to get an actual, you have to actually let it go by itself to the right. And that'll give you the exact location where it's set to the right. We want it to go basically a 90 degree angle in this situation. So we're a little bit over to the right. We want to go a little more to the left. So I'm going to turn it a bit more that way, underneath the turret on the stem. Then I'm going to speed it up and let it return and check it again naturally by itself. Okay, that's where we want it, yeah, right there. So now we're going to set the left stop, and that's adjustable with the key. Key goes in until it, you feel like you've got in there. Okay, now it's solid in there, right to the bottom. And I'm going to turn counterclockwise to reduce the arc. Just check it, speed it up. Looks like I'm hitting the fence a bit. So I'll have to go a little bit more counterclockwise. And now it's perfectly right along the fence. And that's done. Thank you for watching. And if you like the video, please hit like and subscribe. And for more smart irrigation tips, Check out our website at smartirrigation.com. Whoa!